I-24 eastbound was shut down this morning for hours after an 18-wheeler fire. That wreck happened near Kimball in Marion County. News Channel Line's Catherine Marchand was there and tells us how drivers were affected. When we first arrived on scene, a trooper told us the cleanup would probably take a while, and he wasn't exaggerating. Tennessee Highway Patrol shut down both lanes of I-24 East to get this tractor trailer fire under control. Just after 7 a.m., they reopened one lane. But then the fire started again. And firefighters were called back to the scene to put it out. Creating another round of gridlock. Traffic backed up for miles. We were just sitting here, ran up on this, and just been sitting here just having a conversation. Motorcyclist Kevin Wooten and his girlfriend Lori had a long wait. Yeah, we were late for work. We called our boss back there. We worked at the Harley dealership, and we called him back there and let him know, hey, it shut down, and he had already told us, we know. Just make it back when you can. Tennessee Highway Patrol says the driver of the truck noticed that the trailer brakes had caught on fire. He was able to stop on the shoulder and disconnect the tractor. He wasn't hurt, but the trailer was destroyed. Often when this happens, the trailer, they're able to get the trailer brakes put out. Uh, the entire trailer doesn't burn up. In this case, it continued to burn. Inside the trailer, bathtubs, stalls, and fiberglass, which spilled out onto the roadway. Usually it would be shut down for minutes instead of hours. After THP got the all clear from the fire department, the left lane was reopened. And Kevin, Lori, and hundreds of others were on the move. If you're ever stuck in another traffic jam in that area, you can take exit 143 and use Highway 2 to avoid major delays. Catherine Marchand, News Channel 9. And for all the traffic updates, the latest ones, you can depend on our website, newschannel9.com, or follow Beth Newhoff on Twitter at Traffic Tracker 9.